Hello everyone. Um, I wanted to make a video today um, just to kind of hit on two things that's happened um, in the last few days. And I just kind of wanted to get it out there. Um, I'll tell you the first thing that happened was the day before yesterday, actually, the day before yesterday, um, in the evening. Um, right before um, I went to bed, I heard in my spirit Isaiah 34. I read it. Um, I really feel like this is referring to that what is coming. So in the middle of the night, I woke up and I heard in my spirit, it's time. So the next morning, I just, as I've always felt um, this urgency to really, um, I guess, wake people up to really understand the times that we're in and to um, embrace what is going on right now and, and, and to really understand the times that we're living in right now. Um, some people just refuse to see it. Um, they don't want to, um, I guess, acknowledge that this is the last days. I'm just assuming um, that's the, the case. So, um, and along with that, I really feel like it's time that, you know, Christians really start to show who they are in, in the Lord. Um, for me, I just feel like it's not for you to carry in a selfish way. Um, it's for you to basically go out and, and try to help people and really, um, you know, help the unbelievers come to Christ, I guess is what I'm trying to say. Also, um, I just feel like a complacency um, amongst um, a lot of Christians, this feeling that, um, I don't know, like there's not this sense of urgency, I guess, and it kind of bothers me a little bit. Um, and just, you know, making sure that you realize that being a Christian is not for selfish reasons and your own salvation, that it's for other people, and that your call here um, is to do that to get in, involved in something that will help other people or or to you know basically go out and tell people or help you know take every opportunity use it to your advantage to help the kingdom of God and I want to say this too because I really feel this strongly that um, I'm nothing special uh, God has taken me on this journey um, in this direction and um, Anyone, anyone can hear from God if you just get an intimate relationship with Him. People that hear from God, um, I feel, are no different than anybody else. They just um, are getting intimate with Christ. They're learning to hear His voice. They're listening to what He has to say. They're, they're paying attention to what He's showing them. And you are, just allow yourself to open up, allow yourself to hear His voice, and, and start pressing into Him and getting close to Him, um, and anyone can hear from God. I really believe that. Okay, so I want to go into the second thing. Um, the dream last night, I had a dream that there was two powerful people in this room I was speaking with. I knew that they were like a powerful, political two people. One was Asian, one, I don't, he's just a white guy. I don't know who they are, could not recognize them. Um, we were talking about the Antichrist, who the Antichrist is. Um, the, the white Caucasian guy, um, I was asking, who is the Antichrist? And he was saying, who his, for he was a representation of his country. This is who I think the Antichrist is. And then I looked at the Asian guy and I said, do you think Obama is the Antichrist? And he said, yes. And I said, so you think the Antichrist is Obama, right? And I knew in my spirit I was convinced that it was him. At that moment, a huge explosion happened. I didn't see fire, I didn't see, I just knew it was a huge explosion. And I saw debris just taking people out. Um, and that was my dream. So I don't know if what this means. I have no idea. Um, I mean, I know that people have said that he is Antichrist. I don't know, I have no clue. Um, I don't think that we'll be here to see it. I don't think so. Um, if we are, I'll be surprised, but, so I don't know, I just wanted to share this, I, um, I just want to get that out there, um, if you're a Christian, I would, I would suggest really pressing into God, getting close to God, getting intimate with God, and let's be warriors for Christ, and let's 
let's do what we're called to do here on earth. Our citizenship is not on earth. It is in heaven. And while we're here, let's make the best of every opportunity. And let's get um, right with God and get our homes ready. And uh, let's do the will of God. Let's expand the kingdom of God. All right, I hope this blesses you. I hope um, someone can, um, if you have any insight into this, let me know. Um, I'm praying for everyone. I'm praying for this world. God bless. Have a wonderful day. Bye.